Hey there, my name is Jason Bryce and I'm the CEO of Plastic Piranha. Today I'm going to show you how to get started with the recoil level editor and mod tools. First, we need to locate our editor and then launch it. The bat file executable can be found inside your Steam folder at the following location. For some, the drive letter may change depending on where you've installed your Steam directory. In this directory, you will find the bat file simply called editor. Double clicking on this file will launch the recoil editor. Now that the editor is launched, we will begin by creating a new blank map. In the upper left corner of the editor in the file menu, you will want to pull down to the new level option. Once pressed, you will see a number of templates for creating a starter map. For today's example, we will press morning lighting. This will create a brand new base map that should look identical to this. Now, let's take a look at some of the content available to you in the Recoil Editor. Basically, every mesh, every texture, every character, and every bit of everything you imagined it would take to make Recoil is at your fingertips in the browser. We can get to the Content Browser by hitting Ctrl plus Shift plus F at the same time. Once in the browser, we can start to look at some of the items we can use to start building our map. Today I think we will construct a simple building with a door and a staircase. We can start by searching for a doorway. Now, in the top of the content browser there is a search field. Let's type door, and below in the browser you will see all of the available items labeled with door in their name. Let's filter our list to only show static meshes. These meshes are what all mappers will need to use for creating their levels. As a result, you will see all of the static meshes with door in their name. All right, let's grab this door, this door frame, and this doorway. Then, let's line them all up. Let's now grab a wall by doing the same thing we did before. Type wall in the search field, and all of the walls in the build will be shown in the browser. Let's grab this wall, and copy it a few times by holding down the Alt key and dragging to the desired location. Now, I want to replace some of the solid walls with some walls that have pre-cut windows in them. Select the walls that are being replaced and highlight the windowed walls in the editor. Then, right-click and hit Replace with the selected windowed walls. We also need a foundation and a roof. We can actually use the same item for both purposes in Recoil. Type block in the search field and all the meshes with the word block in the build will be shown in the browser. We will drag this onto the scene and start to lay our foundation. By using the alt drag copy method we discussed earlier, we can lay out a floor rather quickly. Now we can make our roof. First select all of the block foundation pieces. Once selected, drag copy these up to our roof line. We can even add a little trim to the building roof line. Search trim in the content browser and select the desired piece. Let's also add some columns. And let's not forget about the staircase. I think we are now ready to start running around our new building. But first, we have to do one more very important step. In the content browser, there is a tab in the top left. Hit the tab titled Actor Classes. Then, in the search field, type R Player. This is short for our player start, which is what Recoil uses to tell the game that there is a spawn point at that location. Drag the our player start underscore DM onto the map where you wish the first player start to be. Next, let's right click in the level to play from here. So this is great, but you will notice the lighting needs a little bit of work. The default morning map comes with a dominant directional light that is a little bright, so let's tone that down a little bit. 
Select the light in the level and press F4 or right click and open properties. In the light component section, change the brightness from 5 to 2. Then in the upper left corner, there is a build menu. Pull down to the build lighting tab and go through the desired options. Now go ahead and build the lighting. All right, let's see the result. Well, that looks great. Congratulations on your first recoil building. Check back for more recoil how-to videos coming soon. Recoil.